So one other thing I want to show you about installing drivers uh, while we're talking about it, especially for the TV card here. Um, if you delete them and it automatically reinstalls like this computer just did on me, um, the other way to do it, and you have to again do the capture first and then the TV tuner, is to click on the video capture card, right click and say update driver. You'll automatically go to the wizard and you're going to say yes this time only. Don't ever let it install automatically if you're trying to change it or it'll install the exact same wrong drivers on you. So you say install from a list or specific location. Then you say don't search, I'll tell you where they're at. Next, say have disk. Again, at that point you're going to browse to the C drive. You're going to open up the C drive and go to that um, TV, TV tuner folder. So there's my TV tuner folder. I'm going to double click on that. And again, this is where I have to then pick which which uh, driver I'm trying to install, whether it's the Easy TV card, the um, new Sabrent card, which is the one with the colored plugs and only one TV coax connector, or the uh, Sabrent TV card original, which is the one with the black connectors and only one uh, coax cable connector. So I go there next, do the exact same thing that we just saw in the other video. I would double click on the folder, then look for the drivers, and then say the TV capture is first. And then, as soon as you do that, it's going to break the connection to the TV tuner and, and should come up again and, and ask you for the new drivers. If it doesn't, you can do the exact same thing we just did, which again is just right click on it, update driver, and then you'll get the driver wizard and you just force it to say yes, install from a location, pick the per exact location and force it to use the drivers that you know are the ones that work. So again, make sure you know which ones work. Look at the back of the PC to make sure you've got uh, uh, you've got a good handle on which ones go with which first, and then get the drivers updated. I will say one other thing uh, while we're here. There's two pieces of TV software. One of them said Easy TV. The other one um, doesn't say Easy TV. If they've got an Easy TV card, they should be using the Easy TV software. If they've got the Sabrent cards, they both use the other piece of software that looks a little bit different. Uh, on the screen. That one looks like this right here. It's the inner, uh, inner video. It says WinDVR3. I may have changed the name, but that's the icon that you should see there for the Sabrent TV cards, which is what I've got in my computer. And I actually have been trying to delete the wrong icon, so they only use the piece of software that we know that they want to use, or they should be using.